Meanwhile, Louisiana state troopers are investigating a shooting involving Homa police officers and a mentally ill man. According to the LSP, an officer shot the man after a brief scuffle. The man's mother told Paul Murphy her son was having a breakdown and that she pleaded with police not to kill him. Police were called to investigate a disturbance on downtown court in Homa. I called 911 and I said, my son is schizophrenia, bipolar. He have a mental disorder. I said, when they come out here, I said, send some policemen with experience in that area for they won't kill my child. I Lorraine said, McGee says late Monday afternoon, her 36 year old son, Johnny McGee, was having a mental breakdown when two Homa police officers arrived in the parking lot in front of her trailer home. She admits her son could get aggressive when having one of his episodes. When he in his flash, when he flash out, he's like that. Especially if you go up on him, he gonna start fighting you. Yes, yes, he gonna start fighting you to protect himself. According to the state police, McGee scuffled with police and one of the Homa officers discharged his weapon. Neighbor LaShonda King witnessed the shooting. So he did come running out the trailer, running like this at them. All you heard was pow, 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 four times. Lorraine McGee says her son was not armed. I say, why y'all shooting him? I say, he disabled. I say, he mentally, he don't know what he's doing. He hearing voices. I say, don't kill him. Please don't kill him. Please don't kill him. Homa police invited the McGee family to view the responding officer's body-worn camera video of the shooting. His sister tells me what they all want to know is what prompted police to shoot a mentally ill, unarmed man, and did they have any other option other than to kill him? Louisiana State Police are investigating the shooting. They didn't have to kill him. They could have tased it. Oh, no, what am I going to do? In Homa, Paul Murphy, Eyewitness News. And late this afternoon, the state police revealed that Johnny McGee charged at an officer while holding a screwdriver. Police say the officer gave commands to stop, but McGee raised his arm with the screwdriver in it and moved toward one of the officers. And according to the LSP, uh, that is when the officer discharged his service weapon.